Hello friends, today we are going to see how we can create gradient text and gradient buttons in Elementor without any additional plugins. Hi, this is Anand from designtheway.com. Excited to learn? Let's get right into it. So here I'm using one of the page from the digital agency template. Now let's say on this page, I want to add gradient color to this headline. And for the buttons, this one and this one, I would like to have them gradient too. For this, of course, we can use some free plugins. But if I just want to create this gradient colors, I would rather use normal CSS rather than add another additional plugin. In this video, I will show you how you can create your custom gradient colors and use it in your CSS without you needing to write the CSS on your own. There are many online gradient generated tools out there. One of them is this one cssgradient.io this is a very useful tool here you can generate your own custom gradient colors once you generate the code all you need is to just copy this code and paste it in your css that's it to generate your own color just simply click over here or you can click directly over here and change the color from here just like this you can drag the slider to change the position let's say I want just two colors let's remove this you can change the angle from here like this and you can see the preview over here This is a linear gradient. If you want, you can use radial gradients. Let's stick with linear for now. There are some presets over here. You can choose from them as well. Now in case you want some inspiration, you can head over to swatches. There are some predefined gradient colors over here. If you like anyone, just simply click over here and your CSS code will be copied. For more inspiration, you can go to backgrounds as well. Now this section, it's pulling the data from different websites. This one is from Gradient. Here you can find a lot of predefined gradient colors. Let's scroll down. There are more pages over here. Let's say you like this color. If you want to edit it, simply click over here. You can change the position of the colors. To change the color, click over here and you can change the color from here. In case you want to add another color simply click over here a new color will be added once you're happy with it simply click over here to change the angle simply click over here and just take your mouse like this and angle will be changed once you're happy with the angle just click now to get the CSS just come over here and click on copy CSS and your CSS will be copied. Similarly, there are more resources over here which you can use as inspiration or you can use them directly. Let's go to UI gradients. These are more like a background gradients. You cannot edit them just click over here 
just use them as inspiration if you like any just click over here and you will get the CSS like this let's go to gradient hunt this one is similar you cannot edit the colors but in case you want to use it as it is just click over here and your CSS will be copied there are similar resources over here let's go to gradient buttons these gradients are specifically for buttons and they have animations too like this again you can you cannot edit the colors over here just click over here to copy the CSS these are meant to be used as inspiration but if you want to generate your own color the best option is to use the gradient is the CSS gradient generator now let's get back to our elementor page let's say I want to add a gradient color to this title let's open the editor now let's select the text as you can see in the styles we only have solid colors there is no option to add gradient colors as of now so now let's go to advanced let's click on custom CSS since this one is using h2 let's check it over here let's go to content the HTML tag is h2 to target them let's go to custom CSS let's type selector and then h2 to target this title Now let's say I want to use this type of gradient for my heading. What I will do, let's select this container, let's go to style, let's copy the color code. Let's copy the color code. Let's copy it. Now we'll go back to my gradient generator. Let's paste it over here. Now we'll do the same for this color let's copy it now let's paste it now let's change the angle a bit let's keep it to 90 now once I'm once we're happy with the color just simply need to copy this CSS now let's head over to our title let's paste the code over here as you can see the h2 container has the gradient color but instead we want this title to have the gradient color for this we need to add some additional CSS let's do that let's paste it over here we are using the webkit background clip property and the webkit text fill color property now as you can see our text has a gradient color we can edit the text as usual let's go to style we can change the font size let's say change it to 50 as you can see it's working let's change the width to bold you can change the text everything is working perfectly all we needed is to add this simple little CSS now to reuse this gradient color on other headings all we need is to just copy it just paste it wherever you want like this and change the basic styling 
like this let's change the font size and we are good to go let's remove this text for now and now I want the gradient color on this button as well let's select the button let's go to advance let's go to custom CSS let's type selector and this time I will target the anchor tag now all I need is to just go to the gradient generator and just copy this CSS just paste it over here as you can see the button has the gradient color it's as simple as that once you add the color from the CSS you will lose the hover effect that you're using from the style section this one now to add our own hover effect I will add an extra line of CSS let's type background size let's say 200 person pardon and for the hover I will again type selector hover and over here. now for I will type background position right center now let's hover over the button as you can see we have a beautiful animation over here now if you want to reuse this button just simply right click over here copy let's paste it let's set the alignment to center and there we have it now let's review the changes let's scroll down there is our gradient title and our gradient button so with just small little CSS we can create this beautiful gradient button and title I will add the post link in the description below from where you can download the CSS I know there are some powerful add-ons which add additional features to Elementor but if you are planning to use an additional add-on to achieve just these basic things I would rather prefer using CSS rather than adding an extra plugin I hope you have learned something new today if you like the video please do subscribe to the channel and hit the like button thanks for your time i'll see you in the next video till then bye bye take care